I didn't know what to think of the Davidians. I don't have a religion, which I think means that I looked at theirs pretty neutrally. Um, and I brought my wife down to see the ruins. She's Venezuelan. The Venezuelans at the time of the conquest were Indians. She looked at all the, how do you say, ashes. And she said, I never thought I would get a chance to see what your country did to the Indians. And then I said, Sitting Bull died in something like this. And what had happened was he belonged to the ghost dance religion, which believed Jesus was going to come back to the world, cover the earth with a new layer of soil, and bury all the white people underneath it. And the federal government sent cavalry in to arrest him. A gunfight developed. And that was Mount Carmel a hundred years before. I'm today impressed that the stories told at this memorial today could be told in Vietnam, could be told in Iraq, could be told in Libya and Yemen, because our government is trigger happy and it moves before it has grounds and it moves with deadly force. Uh, subsequent to all of this, in 1995, <clears throat> a group called the Sandinistas in Mexico broke out of the jungle. They were Indians, shot up some towns. The federal government sent in the army. It encircled them in the jungle where they lived. They retreated to it. And the Mexican government stood by for three years. It says, we're not going in to get them because they're children there. That's what our government should have said. And it had far more resources than the Mexican army had. 